All right, what's up everybody? Larry Porter here and I'm back once again. Back with Time to Unwind. I just wanna share in today's video how to send wine as a gift. Now, if this is your first time watching this video, don't forget to smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that bell notification so you do not miss any important updates from us. Now that we got that all out the way, let's jump straight into it. So let's say you have a friend or someone and you wanna send some wine to them in the mail, kinda like a gift, and you're not sure about how to do this. Well, in today's video, I'm gonna share with you how to do this accordingly. Even though it sounds as easy as putting the wine in a box and shipping it off, there are a few things to take into consideration before putting wine in the mail. For example, you need to check your recipient's state laws for wine delivery, know your recipient's wine preferences, carefully package each bottle of wine, find the right packaging, take weather into consideration, know that some wines travel better than others. But when it comes to state alcohol laws, it is illegal in the U.S. for non-licensed individuals to ship wine through the mail. If you would like to send someone wine, you will need to buy wine through a licensed company. The good news is there are many companies that can send these fine wines, vintages, bottles, gift baskets, and club memberships to your recipient on your behalf. With knowing this, the best way that I would recommend is to go through a licensed company. By going through a licensed company, you don't have to worry about any of the things I mentioned earlier, like checking your recipient's state laws for wine delivery, carefully packaging each bottle of wine, finding the right packaging, taking weather into consideration, and so on and so on. Now, I know all that stuff can be a hassle, all of that will be done by the company, so that means no headache for you. And you can assure that your wine will get to its destination safely. All you would need to do is know what their preferences are, go online, order it, and send it directly to them as a gift. That's it. That's what I recommend. I recommend going through a licensed company to the point where you can get your wine shipped to them legally and legitimately without any of a headache and hassle to you. Just go to Google and search out a few keywords for like online wine delivery or online wine retailers. But if you really want to know the wine retailer I recommend, stay tuned because I'm going to share with you the online wine company I use and how it will work for you when sending wine as a gift. You do not want to miss this. Please stay tuned. guys welcome back welcome back thanks for staying tuned so the wine retailer that i recommend for sending wine as a gift will be one hope one hope is one of the largest direct to consumer wineries in the world and has proudly donated over eight million to local and global causes one hope's award-winning wines are made from the finest grapes sourced from the world-renowned winemaking regions i must say once i found out about one hope i decided to become affiliated with them as well i'm going to leave the link in the description to the one hope site so be sure to click on it to learn more about one hope now back to showing you how to send a gift to someone on the one hope site now once you have clicked the link in the description you will land on a page that looks like this. If you see my wife's face, you're in the right place as this is her affiliated link with One Hope. Once you are here, click on the shop link in the upper left corner or the shop with me button. Then from there, select gifts on the left side. Once on the gift page, you have many options for bidding the perfect gift for your recipient that meets their preferences. Once that is done, simply add to cart, enter in your recipient's information and leave the rest to One Hope. Now, One Hope only ships within the U.S. as of now, so be sure to keep that in mind. So there you have it in a nutshell, how to send wine as a gift. Now, you know what time it is, right? It's comment time. I want to know your feedback. What is your favorite type of wine? Is it dry, sweet, off dry? What type of wine you like best? Be sure to leave that in the comment section below. Also, if you want to learn more about various different wines, be sure to click that link in the description below to the point where you can learn about One Hope wines, a little bit more about One Hope. So I'm gonna leave that link in the description as well. All right, guys, so that's all for today's video. I hope you guys found value. So don't forget to like and share with others. All right, I'm Larry Porter signing off with Time to Unwind. I will see you on the next video. Be blessed. Bye-bye.